Hello, and welcome to another big question. Take a look at this picture. This is a food market in London. What do you think is happening here? These people are buying food, like fruit, vegetables, and cheese. And how are they buying things? They're using money. And that is today's big question. Why do we use money? People have bought their food at markets like this for centuries. But they didn't always use the money the way we do today. At first, people exchanged things they had to get things they needed. We call this bartering. Then they used shells, like these, to buy things. They were light, easy to carry, and didn't break easily so they were very useful. Soon though, people made the first coins out of metal. We still use coins today. We use paper money to buy things too. But how do we get money? This is Sarah. She has a part-time job in a hotel. She spends her money on lots of things like clothes and her mobile phone, she also donates some of her money to her favorite charity. This is Max. He doesn't have a part-time job, but he does chores around the house for pocket money. He also gets money for fixing bikes. He saves almost all this money to buy video games. We have jobs so we can get money. We then use our notes and coins to pay for things in shops. But online shopping is becoming more and more popular. You can buy almost anything online and you pay for it electronically. There are special plastic cards for this. We use debit cards to pay people directly from our bank account. We use credit cards too. They allow us to borrow money from the bank for a short time. We pay them back later. Someday, we might not need notes and coins at all. We still use money for the same reasons we always did. We can use it to buy things, we can save it and buy something expensive, or we can even donate money to charity. But our money now comes in lots of different forms.